Sunrise Gano. This is Wei Jie Chan speaking from Shenzhen. Here, I would like to send my condolence to Professor Kara's family and share my memory about him with you all. Professor Kara was my MA advisor and co-advisor for my PhD. When I got a message from my friend Huang Bo about that Professor Kara passed away, I was deeply saddened. I first met Professor Kara in August 2008. I remember we sat in his office in Good Body Hall and discussed my future study at IU. I asked him among Russian, German, and French, which language should I take first as my research language? He paused, looked at me, and killed me slowly with his tender and soft hungry. If you have time, you should take all of them. I have always enjoyed the time when I brought a question to him during his office hour. He might say he is not an expert on this topic and then give me an explanation for 30 minutes. Then I realized when he says that he was comparing himself with those top scholars on that topic. I miss the New Year pictures with Hotum Mongo Bichik. He drew and stuck on Karen's store. I miss the panel I participated with him and Professor Peter Zim at the BIAC 2011. I also feel excited and happy to witness the moment when he was awarded the PIAC medal. Elias Berling, my mentor in Tibetan studies, once said, if one day a bomb were dropped on Good Body Hall and all Sioux people were gone except Professor Kara, he could still rebuild the Sioux department independently. When I heard him saying this, I had no doubt of his words. From Xiu Cai, Medican to Bo Shi, I have always felt fortunate and privileged to study under his guidance. Sailing on the sea of knowledge, he is the Alton Gadas, the polar star in Mongolian showing me the right direction. He is always my role model. I believe he will be missed by all of us. Rest in peace, my mentor, Professor Kara, until we meet again. <laughs>